Yeah, it's a competitive world out there, huh? A global rat race for the title of the tallest, biggest, fastest, you get it. How about we make the most unusual comparisons and see where you can find record holders of all kinds? The world's fastest roller coaster is in the Ferrari World theme park in Abu Dhabi, UAE. The thing takes just five seconds to reach its top speed of 150 miles per hour. You complete the one mile track in just over a minute and a half, and then you barf. The slowest roller coaster in the world is in Germany, and it's a walkable one. Yep, your speed depends on how fast you can climb the steps of the 69 foot tall structure. Hey, there's a loop in everything. The biggest sports stadium in the world is in North Korea. It can seat 114,000 people, which is the entire population of Springfield, Illinois. To see the world's smallest stadium, just look at your typical foosball table. Yeah, okay, fine. If we're going by capacity, there are plenty that tie with 40,000 max. Russia's Fisht Olympic Stadium, Rentschler Field in the U.S., Japan's Oida Bank Dome, just to name a few. Venezuela's Jason Orlando Rodriguez Hernandez has the largest shoe size today. He wears an unimaginable U.S. size 26. The average for men varies from 9 to 12. The tiniest adult shoes are custom-made for Indian actress Jodi Amj, the world's smallest woman. She's just over 2 feet tall, and her shoe size is about a 2 in the infant's department. The biggest private house in the world is a 27-story personal skyscraper that belongs to Indian businessman Mukesh Anbani. The Mumbai home is 550 feet tall, almost as tall as the Washington Monument. The world's tiniest house was built by nanorobotics researchers in France. The itsy-bitsy construction is so small that it wouldn't even fit a mite. And still, the house has seven windows, a chimney, and a tiled roof. More than I can say about my apartment. Porcelain Palace, the largest public restroom in the world, is in Chongqing, China. It's not a single bathroom, but a gigantic four-story, 32,000-square-foot complex with 1,000 toilets. Hey, if you're there, mention my name and you'll get a good seat. The most compact loo in the world has to be Britain's futuristic-looking vertebrae vertical bathroom. It consists of seven units, or modules, that can be rotated with a push. There's one commode, a sink, the toilet's tank, two showers, one a bit higher than the other, and two storage drawers. The fastest train in the world is the Shanghai Maglev. It runs along a high-speed magnetic levitation line at a maximum speed of 268 miles per hour. The world's slowest express train runs in Switzerland. <laughs> During the trip, the Glacier Express averages just 24 miles per hour. Now, the most expensive commercially available pizza in the world costs $2,700, or $250 for just one slice, and is sold in an upscale Italian restaurant in New York City. Black squid ink dough, sprinkled with one of the most expensive kinds of cheese in the world, caviar, and 24 karat gold leaves. Would you be willing to eat that much money? And if we talk about the U.S., you can find the cheapest plain pizza in Alaska. There, you'll pay about $7.25 for a large one. The biggest dog in the world, if we talk about its weight, was Chloe, a mastiff that weighed 365 pounds, as much as a full-grown reindeer. Chloe lived in Tibet back in the 80s. The smallest living dog is Millie, a chihuahua from Dorado, Puerto Rico. When the tiny thing was born, she didn't even weigh one ounce and could fit in a teaspoon. Now, this itsy-bitsy pooch's height is just under four inches. The longest escalator and moving walkway system is in Hong Kong. The Central Mid-Levels Escalator is 2,600 feet long and goes just one way at a time, depending on rush hour. The world's longest individual escalators are at the, um, um, let's just throw the names up on the screen. Thanks. Subway stations in St. Petersburg, Russia. To get down, you'll have to take a 453-foot-long escalator ride, which is as tall as the Great Pyramid of Giza. As for the shortest escalator in the world, it's in the basement of Moore's department store in Kawasaki, Japan. It has only five steps and is just over two and a half feet long. The loudest city in the world is Mumbai, India. Its noise level is more than 100 decibels, which is almost as loud as a chainsaw. 
The world's quietest place is a room in a Microsoft research lab in Redmond, Washington State. Ooh. It's so eerily quiet that no one can stay there for more than 45 minutes at a time. Supposedly, you can hear your own heartbeat. If you want to see the tallest building in the world, you'll need to book a trip to Dubai. The Burj Khalifa is a jaw-dropping 2,720 feet tall, which makes it two times taller than the Empire State Building. The world's littlest skyscraper is the Newby McMahon Building in Wichita Falls, Texas. It's just 40 feet tall, roughly the height of a telephone pole, and got the nickname because it looks like a thin column. Next to the Burj Khalifa, there's the world's tallest hotel, the JM Marriott Marquis Dubai. This impressive construction is 1165 feet high, which is even taller than the Eiffel Tower. And the world's smallest is, oh golly, let's put up the name guys, I always stumble over umlauts. Anyway, it's in Bavaria. The building is a mere 8 feet wide and has a floor space with a square footage not much more than 3 parking spaces. No wonder the hotel can't accommodate more than two guests at a time. The tallest bridge in the world is the Malou Viaduct in southern France. Its maximum point soars at 1,125 feet above the ground, which is really high for a bridge. The smallest drawbridge in the world is in Bermuda. There, Somerset Bridge connects Somerset Island with the mainland. The length of the bridge is a little over two and a half feet. The world's most expensive private jet is a Boeing 747-8 VIP. It originally cost 358 million bucks, but customization took the total price up to 558 million. As for the one with the lowest price tag, it would be the small Cirrus Vision jet that will set you back just $2 million. The biggest school in the world is in Lucknow, India. It's the City Montessori School where you'll find almost 40,000 students and well over 2,000 teachers. The title for the smallest goes to an elementary school in the teeny town of Alpet, Italy. In 2014, it was attended by just one eight-year-old student. The largest art museum in the world is the Louvre. You'll love to see it. <laughs> the Parisian landmark covers a total area of almost 783 square feet. That's over 13 football fields. Now, have you noticed how we compare two things that have absolutely nothing in common other than size? But wait, there's more. The world's smallest museum is in West Yorkshire, England. The Worley Museum used to be a phone booth, hence why this museum can only have one visitor at a time. It also changes exhibitions every three months. The largest plant in the world grows in the Sequoia National Park in California. It's a tree nicknamed General Sherman, and the giant is 271 feet tall, almost as tall as Lady Liberty. Whoops, there's another one. <laughs> Together with its root system, it weighs around 1,800 tons. That's over 15 blue whales. Whoops, there we go again. Now, duckweed is the world's smallest flowering plant. The thing is smaller than a grain of sand and has a tiny root with one or two leaves. The plant flowers every year and even produces a microscopic fruit. The Earth's slowest animal is the three-toed sloth. Its maximum speed is 15 feet per hour. That's why these animals don't usually wander further than 100 feet a day and are pretty much stuck in one place. The world's fastest land animal is the cheetah. Its speed can reach 75 miles an hour. Hmm, let's see, that's 26,400 times faster than the sloth. And the feline can go from 0 to 60 in less than 3 seconds. Venezuelan-born stunt performer Ernesto Gaines of Medina used the smallest parachute in the world for his 2014 jump in Dubai. His parachute's canopy was just 35 feet square. That's about the same as three bath towels sewn together. The world's most massive canopy formation was created by 100 skydivers who linked up mid-air above Florida. Doing so, their combined canopies were as big as a Boeing 747. If just one skydiver had made a mistake, all the participants could have crashed into each other, which wouldn't have been good, let's just put it that way. The world's smallest reproduction of a printed book is Teeny Ted from Turnip Town. The thing is etched on a microchip the width of a human hair. It's impossible to read this book without a scanning electron microscope. The largest published book is The Little Prince. This record-breaking edition is almost 7 feet tall and over 10 feet wide when open, 
That's over 200 times bigger than the book's typical copy. And that's all I got. Good thing, too, the comparisons alone about wore me out. I mean, come on, the General Sherman and a blue whale? Hey, if we could see General Sherman riding the blue whale, well, I'd watch that.